name's Helen and I'm the social media manager. And my name's Luke and I'm the video content manager. We recently just got back from India. We started in Mumbai and then we travelled down to Kerala. We were there for 10 days in total. My recommendation is actually to book yourself on a street food tour. So we did that at the start of the tour and we got a guided tour, we went round and we got to taste like all the wonderful treats that India had to offer. And it really helped when we were ordering when we like carried on our journey because we knew what we liked and what we didn't like. The Spice Market was a really interesting place. It's so visual as well and as, as people like to take video and, and pictures it was um, a perfect place to get that. The, the, the spices are piled high, there's bags full of chilies everywhere um, and there's rows and rows of shops essentially all selling the same thing. <laughs> Um, which is actually really interesting because what our guide told us is that everybody has their own favourite um, shop that they go to. They all, they all sell very similar spices, but they all have their local one they go to. And when, once they've collected them, they take them to the top of the road um, where they get them all ground up, um, they get them roasted, everything that they need so they have their spices all done, ready for the next six months to a year, which I, I thought was really interesting. So we spend one night on a houseboat, which if you're going to go to Kerala, I think you've got to do it. Going from the contrast of Mumbai and then like going into just like floating down like the lakes in Alapi and... Very peaceful. So, so, so peaceful. And just to like just sit on your boat and I was expecting, if I'm honest, like a canal boat. Mm, yeah. Like really short and like skinny, but it was... It was a lot bigger than I expected, very spacious and very luxurious as well. It's really difficult to pick one particular place for food that really stood out, but there was one thing we did which um, really will stick with me, and that was going to somebody's home and cooking with them. So they taught us um, how to make naan bread, which uh, we eat a lot as Brits, but we never ever cook, I don't think. So it was really interesting to see how that's cooked and the amount of food that they made for us, all the different food, um, the curries, there was fish, a, a bit of everything, and it was all delicious. The way that we arrived and the way we got welcomed into the community, and then I would say in about five minutes, we're like covered like head to toe in like all the colors and all the paints, and the kids were just like leading us off, and then, um, yeah, it was just, it was just like such, like an amazing experience that mm. I mean I've always wanted to do and I don't think really we get the opportunity to do it again with that neighbourhood like in that situation and yeah just to be welcomed in it was yeah it was quite special. Yeah them welcoming us it's part of their community um, they wanted us to get involved with the Holly Festival straight away covering us in paint it was something I'll never forget. Mm.